episode of Afro Scientific Spirituality. My name is Efe West, reaching your life and direct from the out of Africa. If this is your first time on this journey, you are highly welcome. This is the place where we separate the facts from the fiction, the science from the superstition, and the concept from the misconceptions about African spirituality. Today, I'm going to be talking about the use of the Adam fruit in African spirituality. I'm going to be talking about this very, very important, essential, exotic spice here, and uh, what it is used for in African spirituality. This is one of the most important fruits or spices that uh, you are going to find in West Africa. They call it the Adam fruit. It has lots of native names and it is very, very popular. People know it as uh, Arinda in Yoruba. They also call it uh, Oshosho. Then uh, they call it Osakiris. They also call it Dual or Dab or Enri. In the Yoruba language, it has lots of names. But uh, it is very unique and distinct. Once you see this, you just know what it is. It is a very, very powerful plant. And uh, the botanical name for this very plant is uh, Tetra Pura Tetra Petra. I don't really know how to pronounce this botanical name, so please don't uh, get offended if I push at them. It is not my language, and uh, I'm simply using this name so that it will be very, very easy for people to search for these uh, items, for these plants, and uh, to also be able to know more about them, to, for you to do your own research on them. This plant is a very, very powerful and popular plant in Africa and in the world. There have been lots of research on it. There have been thousands of research on it, and it has been proven to work wonders and to work effectively. In the medical field, before we even go into the spiritual side of things, that have been known to do so many things. In uh, West Africa, and even the whole of Africa, they use it very much for many things. They use it in the treatment of asthma. They use it in the treatment of diabetes mellentus. They use it in the treatment of hypertension, epilepsy, and uh, they also use it to treat what they call snake fever, something they call the schizosomasis or something like that. Then uh, it is also used to treat convulsion in children, also used to treat leprosy, and uh, it is also uh, anti, a sort of antibiotic, and it's also used in the reproductive health. It is very, very uh, important and it's very, very useful for the area of reproduction, for increasing sperm counts, and uh, what they call the steroidogenesis. That is improving efficiency of mountain, as in, a, in the area of sex or making love. It is very, very effective for that department. It is used to stimulate the reproductive organs to make them work very, very well. So this is something that uh, people use, and uh, it is also used to increase sperm count. For those people that are looking for the fruit of the womb, when they say somebody have low sperm count, this is the very thing that you need for solving that problem. So this is a very, very important item. That is why I am bringing it to this channel, okay? It has been known to treat a lot of things, and uh, kills lots of these aliments. Then also too, for women, women use it a lot. It has been known to drink fibroids. It is highly effective in the treatment, prevention, disappearance, and drinking of fibroids. So it is one of the number one thing that they use for that in West Africa. They also use it to reduce uh, heavy menstruation, it is used to balance the hormones in the body for women that have heavy and painful menstruation. This is what they use to solve that problem. So it is very, very important, very, very important item. 
I have been experimenting on this since I came to Africa, and this is the one I have been using. And uh, I can attest to this very thing that it actually works. And uh, the way we use it in West Africa is that we use it to cook pepper soup. We use it to cook stew. You can also add this in your jello fries as well. It has a very, very distinct uh, odor, a very good smell and uh, unmistakable smell. So they cut it, uh, you just break the edges of this and uh, you pound it as a spice. You pound this as a spice, then uh, you put it in your pepper soup, the way you cook your pepper soup spice. Or if you don't want to prepare your pepper soup or your stew, you can just pound it, then you well it or you put it in boiling water then you drink a cup of it just like the way you consume a cup of tea you drink a cup in the morning and in the evening just like that then you go to your normal business it is very very effective this is one thing that is very powerful and uh immediately you start taking it you feel the effects of it almost uh, instantaneously so this herb is something that uh the importance and the efficacy cannot be overemphasized. It is a highly, highly effective, and you really have to try it out for yourself. You can actually go online. There have been hundreds of studies on this very thing online. A lot of research, scientific research, have been conducted on this. Just type the name on your internet, Tetra Pura, Tetra Petra. You're gonna see lots of scientific papers on this especially in the area of the treatment and drinking of fibroids it is very very effective for that so for women that are having problem of fibroids women that have been battling fibroid this is the very thing that you need to get your hands on people use it to treat and cure fibroids without surgery you don't need to go under the knife if you're having problem of fibroids you just simply need to get this and use it to be drinking tea in the morning and evening and it's going to treat your fibroids. It is not only that, it's going to help you reduce any kind of menstrual cramp, heavy menstruation or anything that have to do with that department. And it's also going to increase your libido. It is very, very effective for that, increasing your libido for men that are having difficulty in getting up, getting it up. If you have a partner that is I'm mean, no, not having interest in sex. You don't need to say anything. Just go and get this spice and be using it to cook for them. Don't tell them anything. Just go and buy this. Be using it to cook, putting it in their tea, and uh, they will suddenly develop interest in that very, very department. So this is something that uh, you need to try and uh, you need to get it in your arsenal. I have seen a lot of research paper on this. They have tried many sort of uh, uh, laboratory animals whereby they include this into their water and they find that, that the multi frequency was exponential and uh, the sperm production was also exponential as well. And uh, people that are uh, in the area of uh, spermatogenesis, this is very, very effective for that. So you actually need to get this for people that uh, want you just want general well-being, you want to boost your immune system, you want to, uh, you have an issue of hypertension, any kind of issue, convulsion, leprosy, or you just simply want to improve your, your life, your efficiency and your productivity, you really, really need this uh, Adam fruit. It is very, very important medically for so many things, it is very, very important for that. Then for the spiritual angle of things, it is used to ward off negativity, to ward off bad luck. People use it as a sort of um, spiritual uh, antibiotics. Maybe you are in a place with a lot of negativity, or you feel that something is blocking your way, or you just want to change your hurry, you want to be able to be more attractive or you want to attract favor and prosperity, love and good luck into your life. What you need to do is that you need to take pieces of this thing and uh, you pound it and you mix it with salt and you bait with it or you mix with it other spiritual oils. You can mix with it something like beet El Sudan 
or seeds flower uh, perfume, or you can mix it with, uh, with uh, El Haji Hoye, uh, Dr. Habulai, a lot of those spiritual oils that we use. You just simply mix it with them. Or if you don't have any oil, simply mix it with your sea salt as usual and use it to bake. And it's going to uh, refresh your arrow. It's going to wipe out any sort of attachments, emotional baggages, the kind of uh, anger or hatred, things that have been projected at you to cause problems to your life. It's going to wipe that and it's going to give you the aura of a newborn baby. So that is what it does for you. So you're going to be like fresh, like somebody that just came new to the planet. And uh, everything we start all over again, we start attracting good people and favor and this kind of resets or formats your energetic frequency, your aura or your, your haru, the way the white people we call it. But you just need it to just wash and for a very good effective spiritual baths. It is highly used as a spiritual bath in the spiritual circle. So you need this very, very much, not only for the head benefits, but also for the spiritual benefits. So this is something that is very, very popular. They also call it the four corner because uh, it has four sides. So it solves a lot of spiritual problem and health problem, okay? It is popular in West Africa. If you are living outside Africa, you don't have it in your country, you can order it from me. I can get it for you and post it to your place for you. Okay, it's very, very important and powerful. This is not something that you're gonna wait to see instantly, immediately you start drinking it, you will get the effect, you will start feeling the effect. It is instantaneous. It's a very powerful stuff. And uh, I'm very grateful that uh, Nisho have blessed us with this kind of thing. So uh, if you have any kind of issue that have to do with reproductive health, fibroids, menstrual cramp, or you just want to reset or format your aura or your haru, this is the very thing that you need. You need hardian fruits, okay? You try to get your hands on this thing. As simple as it is, it's very, very powerful. So try to go online, Google the uh, botanical name, and uh, you're gonna see a lot of research. Do your research on this so that you're going to confirm the validity of what I am talking about so you know that uh, I'm not just making things up. It actually works and I have tested it and I am currently using it. Of course, you will see the effect of that on this very one. Yeah. So uh, try to get your hands on this thing, please. You really need this stuff. This is a lifesaver and uh, this is a very powerful, important gift from nature. Okay. So get your hands on it and uh, do your research on this very thing that uh, Tell me about it. I would like to know your own experience because uh, my experience is it's like a testimony. If uh, I want to quote the Christians, it's something that is very powerful and effective. Okay, so this is Hadian fruit for you. There's a lot of things you can do with it and uh, you need this in your arsenal, in your box of tools. It is a lifesaver and uh, it's gonna bring a lot of smiles to people in the world. So this is what I have for you today. Questions and comments are welcome. Like and share this video, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell, close to the subscribe button so you'll be the first to get my videos. And please uh, try to register for my website, www.kindoki.com. That is where I teach uh, the inner secrets of African spirituality. For those people that are interested in going deeper, I talk about how you can be able to practice African spirituality from the comfort of your own home, right inside your home, in any part of the world. You don't need to travel to Africa. You don't need to break your bank because you want to learn African spirituality. You don't need to go to any fake spiritualist. You just register, you see me doing the rites with simple everyday items. You can actually source from any part of the world and uh, you do that and you make contact. Immediately you start making contact with the deities. You have already completed your studies. You don't need any middleman in spirituality. You don't need, you just need to follow up and start learning how to live in harmony with nature and working with powerful herbs like this and uh, you are good to go. Okay, so try to subscribe to my channel, subscribe to my website and uh, 
continue living your life and uh, enjoying life as usual. So I'll be seeing you in the next video. I wish you a very wonderful day. Take care and bye. Peace.